Hello, you wonderful people. This is the second week of our Artbox collab. As you may know, Nasreen, Hartfell and I each made a art box and sent it to the other two. This week it's my week. I don't have a video of unpacking the art box, but I have one where I can show you the painting that I made for it. It's a white butterfly in a very colorful scenery. If you want to see what I added to the art box, you have to watch Nasreen's or Ahadfel's videos. And probably you should watch both. Sorry if you can hear Dante in the background. He's looking for the perfect spot on his cushion. Well, there's one thing that I can tell you that I've put in the art box. Watercolors. I think this is something that you would expect from me. Isn't it? The watercolors I've put in the box are from Schminke and these are Schminke Horadam watercolors. The colors are Indian yellow, quinacridone magenta and helio turquoise. I've also put a White Knight's black, neutral black, in there. Because these are the colors that I've used for my painting too. Basically it's a, a little bit odd or weird primary set that I've put together. I have used quite some swatch sheets to test out the primary colors that I wanted to send there. I didn't want them to be generic. I didn't want to put a lemon yellow, a pink and just so I've put together together a primer set that I liked, but that wasn't usual for a primer set. You can get those um, in a set as they are. What I like about the combination is that you can get pretty nice purples with the set. You also get very nice turquoise colors. The orange is a little bit dulled down, but, and the green is too. You won't add, uh, you won't be able to get a bright green with the set, but I still like it. And because all the colors are so nice and colorful, I chose a painting that is just as colorful to paint. The focal point is the butterfly. And it's the only thing that is monochrome in this painting. I've painted this on Arches watercolor paper. And I can tell you that this is also something that I've put in the art box. But there was so much more. The Arches took the paint pretty well and makes soft, nice transitions in the background. Now I'm pretty much curious what the others have done with these paintings, because I haven't seen it yet. I'll be just as surprised as you are with what they've created with this box. If you like this painting, I've put it in the shop. The link to the shop you can find in the description box down below. Next week it's Nasreen's turn. So if you're curious what she sent us, wait until next Saturday and you can watch us unpack her box and paint another painting with it. Thank you for being here and have a great day. Bye!